Let's talk about how stress, inflammation and certain conditions within our bodies are linked. Now this is an emerging field, but studies show that chronic stress can cause inflammation in the body and increase the risk of a number of physical health conditions. First of all, it's important to say that not all stress is bad. It's our natural fight or flight response to danger. And at the same time, not all inflammation is bad. In the short term, it can help fight infection and help us heal. But it's the chronic stress that many of us have from things like work, finances, relationships that can cause a problem. They trigger an inflammatory response by the body, which over time can do more harm than good. Now, it's important to understand that during inflammation, our bodies send out an army of chemicals called cytokines to attack any foreign invaders. These cytokines should disappear once they've done their job, but this doesn't always happen in long-term stress. This means your stress, if not dealt with or managed, will cause these cytokines to continue to cause inflammation within the body. And although nobody is sure exactly how, all of this can increase the risk of certain diseases, including autoimmune conditions like rheumatoid arthritis, inflammatory bowel disease, as well as other things like cardiovascular disease and depression. Now, it's important to say that stress won't be the sole cause of these diseases, but a possible contributor. And stress isn't often avoidable completely, but doing things like exercise, spending time in nature, meditation, journaling, talking therapy have all been shown to reduce stress and improve health.